Chickenpox is an infection caused by a virus called varicella zoster. It's very common in children, usually affects children under the age of 10, but can also affect adults and older children as well. It's spread through the respiratory droplet route, so that any secretions that come out of the nose or mouth that are coughed or sneezed or touched or wiped um, can be spread to another person. The time from when you first catch the infection to when you first show signs can be between 10 and 21 days. Now, a person will be infectious from two days before the first spots appear until the very last spot has scabbed over. Most children start by having flu-like symptoms that last for a couple of days, so a runny nose, sore throat, a bit of a high temperature. And then they develop spots that usually start on the face and behind the ears and that travel down to the rest of the body. Now the number of spots depends on the child and some children will only have a few, whereas others will have lots of spots. The spots themselves are usually small and red and the following day they get blistered. After um, some time those blisters burst and they scab over and then finally those scabs will fall off. The treatment of chickenpox is symptomatic, so for a high temperature you treat with paracetamol and ibuprofen. Always make sure the child has plenty of fluids to drink. If the spots are very itchy, which they often are, you can use lotion and sponging. And if it's really itchy, you can ask the GP or the pharmacist for some antihistamines, so some anti-itching medication. If your child has chicken pox, it's important to keep them away from certain vulnerable groups such as pregnant women, newborn babies or people with a weak immune system. Very occasionally children can become seriously unwell with chicken pox and things to watch out for would be shortness of breath, um, delirium or confusion in the child or any areas of skin that look like they've got a bacterial infection on top of the chicken pox, so they would be red, painful and swollen. Mm -hmm.